chart creation in starter so to start creating bar chart in starter what you need to do is just open the data set which you want to do the analysis for so my data set is named as and then open it to start running it to visualize the data set what you need to do is just enter in the command edit to ensure the data set which you are doing analysis for is this so my data set contain results of some student in a certain school so it contain name math english and chemistry so to visualize the video on how to enter data in this software it was the video which i have provided the link in the description so to start the analysis what you need to do I just click the option graphics then click the option bar chart after clicking the option bar chart ensure that the type of the data is graph of st summary statistics then in the statistic to plot the variable in our data set is the mathematics which is our scale variable in our data set and then after clicking mathematics just click submit to ensure that you don't close this video you can minimize this screen and continue with analysis so we come to where we have category option and try and categorize our data set we categorize our data set using the name of our respondent so we just click here and choose name and then click submit so here we are doing comparison of the mean of the matrix of the mean of the mathematics and the name of the student you can see we can be able to visualize that Douglas was the highest score in mathematics and the lowest score in mathematics was Francis so you can close the window to visualize and do a lot of comparison comparison we can come back to where we have mean and where we have mean we enter the scale variables who to be represented in the vertical axis or in the y axis so to do it what you need to do is just click tick here and add another variable our another variable is the english and then click submit so we can see we can be able to compare the score in english in english and in mathematics so the comparisons are here you can be able to visualize like samsung seems to have scored well in english as compared to mathematics so we can also come to where we have mean and click this the third variable and enter our third scale variable as chemistry so in most cases in where we have the vertical axis or the y axis we enter the scale variable so i just click chemistry and then click submit so we can compare all the results and be able to visualize where is the weakness of our student so we can uh, after getting here we can also minimize this window and try and give this this graph a title so to name this graph we can name it as bar chart bar chart of student or as specified do some specification or we can say huruka Huruka student bar chart and after doing that we just click submit so you can see now our bar chart is named so other advanced settings you can do them for your own you can try and interact with these interfaces you can see what you can do to your bar chart to make it more more might boggling and also more understandable so thank you for watching this is how you can generate very beautiful bar charts using starter so starter have generate very beautiful visuals which you can use in your analysis since if you want to do to use this graph in, in doing your analysis or research you just need to click it and just click copy and paste it where you want to use it and it is so smart you can make it advanced make fees this thing to read in percentage into percentages you can do a lot of things a lot of things yeah e using these softwares yeah you can do a lot of things you can make these to be shown in percentage or what you like so thank you for watching kind if you don't know how to enter raw data in starter i have a video which i have provided you the link in the description also if you want to have already saved data set in 
starter which you can use to do your analysis you just click the option file and you come to where we have example data set and click the data set installed in, in this software and you can use it to do your practice so this data you just click the option use and you can start running it in in the software you can come here and click edit and you see this example data set which you have been given by starter to do your analysis and do some practice thank you for watching bon appetit don't forget to 